And tonight at 6, the family of a 12-year-old boy hit and killed by a vehicle needs your help finding the driver. Karen Campbell spoke with the boy's family that now is seeking justice. On the near west side of Indianapolis, down this alley near North Elder Avenue and West Michigan Street, tragedy struck. He left my sister's house on Friday the 26th at 6 o'clock in the morning and he was found dead supposedly two hours after, supposedly in this alley. A family now on a relentless pursuit for justice after IMPD says 12-year-old Montarius Crow was hit by a vehicle Friday morning and died. You don't leave a 12-year-old child in an alley. You don't leave your child in an alley. Crow's aunt, Zakiah Cole Morris, says the family wasn't told until Monday. That's because Crow didn't have any ID and was listed as a John Doe. I don't know who hit him. I don't know why they hit him. We don't know if he was running, but the way that his face was brutally swollen and his teeth was knocked out. Crow's family believes he may have been trying to run away from his attacker. You need to have some heart and you need to come and face what you've done. Taking away a part of their family. He was just a happy child. He loved to go play with his friends, basketball, just a typical 12 year old child. A child taken too soon. He didn't even get a chance to live half of his life, but for you to, whoever you are, to run him over and leave his body for dead in the alley, you have to answer to God. And the family, as well as detectives, are asking anyone with information to call them. You can make an anonymous call to Crime Stoppers. That number is 317-262-TIPS. In Indianapolis, Karen Campbell, 13 News.